Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel, where we dive into all things DevOps, system administration and GitLab management. Today we're addressing an essential task, resetting root password in GitLab. If you ever lost access to your root password or need to regain control, this guide is for you. Whether you're managing GitLab on your own server in Docker environment or through the GitLab GUI, I'll walk you through the each method step by step to ensure you're back into the driver's seat in no time. Here's what we'll cover in this video. First, resetting the root password for self-hosted GitLab installations. Next, we resetting the root password in GitLab running inside Docker containers. And lastly, how to reset the root password directly from the GitLab GUI. Let's get started. Please give me a like and subscribe for more content on infrastructure automation, DevOps and system administration. Hit the bell icon to get notified when I post more tutorial like this one. And if you have any question, drop them in the comment below. I'll do my best to help you out. Imagine one day you're trying to log in into GitLab as a root administrator, but GitLab gives you an Eero invalid login or password. Now you have to connect to your GitLab server via SSH as a user with sudo privileges. Open the GitLab Rails console, find the root user and reset the password. and exit the console. Go to GitLab GUI and test the new password by logging in with the root account. The password have reset it. Now I wanna show you how to reset the root password in GitLab running inside Docker container. Access the GitLab container Now open the GitLab Rails console, as you see before, find the root user and finally reset the root password. Now let's try to log in with new password. We have logged it successfully now, as you can see. Now I want to demonstrate how to reset the root password using the GitLab GUI. Go to Profile, click on Preferences, go to Password tab, enter the current password, then enter a new password below. So that's it. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more in-depth attached content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.